welcome back to my channel. Today I am giving you DIY school supplies and I am so excited because these turned out so cute and I feel like they're really creative and I really hope that one of you guys recreates at least one of them because they are so cute. You will get so many compliments if you recreate them, I promise. Alright, so let's just go ahead and get into the video. I forgot to tell you guys that I am doing a giveaway for all of these because I'm not in school anymore and I made all these notebooks and folders and I don't need them. So stay tuned at the end of the video to see how you could win this stuff in the giveaway. So here are some notebooks and folders I picked up for the DIY along with the scrapbook paper I liked and then we are just going to go ahead and start with the supplies you see here and what we're going to do for each notebook is the same but I'm just going to show you on this first one you're going to lay the right side of the scrapbook paper on the inside of the folds or the notebook and then you're going to fold the notebook back over and trace it with a pencil and then you're just going to go ahead and cut that out next we are just going to glue the scrapbook paper onto the notebook and I'm using the E6000 glue I believe it just sticks really well in my opinion to spice up the notebook, I bought these gems at a craft store and I just glued them on with the same glue and I did it slightly towards the top and tried to center it as best I could and I think it makes it really look elegant and cute and yeah, that's the finished look. For the first notebook, I went ahead and used the supplies to create it and I just cut out a piece of scrapbook paper that would fit directly onto the folder and then I went ahead and glued that down. After you glue your scrapbook paper down, you want to take some fabric paint and just go ahead and make your name in cursive with the paint. You don't have to do your name, you could do whatever words you want, but after that we're going to go ahead and take some yarn and just follow the paint that was applied to the note or the folder. And it's a little bit time consuming, a little bit difficult, but you just got to keep working with it and have some patience and you'll get there. Here is the supplies for our second notebook and this one's fairly simple you're just gonna put some glue on top of your notebook after you put your scrapbook paper down and I got this lace at a trim store and I'm just going to lay the lace on there let it stick to the glue and then I'm going to cut it a little bit past the notebook so that I can fold it under and hem it on the side that's near the spirals and then to hem the other side I'm just going to fold the notebook or open up the notebook and fold the trim over and glue it down to the inside. So here is the supplies you are going to need for this folder and I'm just going to make marks on my folder where I want to thread my ribbon through and this folder is a little bit difficult but I know you guys can do it and after I make the marks I'm just going to go ahead and cut with an exacto knife little squares out of where I want to thread it through I used a box cutter here but that's not safe use an exacto knife I just couldn't find my exacto knife and then you just pop the little tab out that you cut out and then you take the ribbon and thread the ribbon through each hole and I just am threading the ribbon in a a horizontal design I guess you could say just going back and forth and I think it ended up really cute after you have laced it the last step is to hem the ends and go ahead and glue the ends down to the inside of your folder <laughs> The third notebook has pretty minimal supplies, so that's good. You're just going to write out a quote that you want on your folder. I chose a quote from The Breakfast Club, and it is, Screws fall out all the time. The world is an imperfect place. And I just think this is a perfect quote for school, because you can just say that to the teachers that are being completely unreasonable with you. You know who I'm talking about, those teachers. And, um, yeah, I just think it's 
comes out really cute and you can do it in a nice little fancy print or font or whatever you want. When I look at you, I know inside At least we both are under the same skies So the supplies in front of you is for our third folder and what you're going to do is take a hole punch and make a little hole in the top corner next to the part that folds over and then you're going to take your keychain and just loop it through the hole of the folder and then you have a cute little folder with whatever keychain your heart desires. Feel so high. So here's the supplies for our last folder and basically you're just going to put some lipstick on and make a lip print in the corner of your notebook and it's that simple and it just makes such a cute simplistic design. So here's everything you will need for the last folder and you just need some fabric to make a cute pocket design and basically just fold over the edges to hem the pocket and then you're going to take the pocket and glue it down to the folder. And that's basically it. I did mine in the middle and you could do fun things like stick pencils in the pocket or whatever you want and just be like a nice little secret pocket for ya. Yeah. Okay, thank you so 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 much for watching that video I hope that you enjoyed it I'm going to try to keep this super short so the video isn't too long but basically for the giveaway all you have to do is subscribe to my youtube channel and follow me on Instagram because I will message the winner on Instagram and comment down below and tell me what should we do oh I have an idea guys okay so what you have to comment down below is the name of my octopus mug. I either want to name him Frederick or MacArthur. So get a good look at him. What does he look like, a Frederick or a MacArthur? Comment down below which one you like best. And then I will pick a winner and I will message you and send you all of this awesome school supplies. And for the folder with the name on it, I will make another one with your name on it or whatever word you want we can talk about it on instagram but yeah um thank you guys so much for watching be sure to go down there and subscribe i have a bunch of back to school videos coming really soon so be sure to do that go down there is it on this side or this side i think it's on that side i don't know go down there subscribe and yeah thank you for watching bye